It's almost a riot in the streets of Brussels as thousands of students surge towards the Finnish embassy. In fact, there are so many of them that the fire brigade comes out to try and hold them off. But they needn't have bothered. All the students want to do is to show their combined rage and sorrow at the fate of Finland. And when the Finnish minister comes out onto the balcony, it must warm his heart to hear the cheers for his country. But when the police arrive to clear them away, the noises aren't nearly so friendly. All the world has been deeply moved by the tragic yet noble story of a small nation fighting for its life. Long live Finland, honor to her soldiers. Up Finland, down with the aggressor. That's what they say, even though more police arrive to stop them. And that's what every honest man feels in his heart. And now come with our cameras again to Finland capital to see for yourself how much the sympathy of the world is justified. Until a few days ago, this was a modern city of wide streets and tall buildings, the home of a happy and prosperous people. But the happiness and prosperity have flown, churches are destroyed, the tall buildings broken, the streets filled with wreckage. This is the mark of warfare against women and children. Into Helsinki Harbour comes a German ship to take away the German residents. These days, as you know, the swastika and the hammer and sickle are entwined. No Russian would harm a single hair on the head of any German. But all the same, they feel they'd better be getting home. That's Russo-German friendship, that was. And the Germans leave not a moment too soon. Again, the Russian bombers zoom over Helsinki. Again, a proud city is shaken by the roar of destruction. Just feel your own heart beating faster as you see the buildings falling under the impact of the bombs. As if in sorrow, the snow begins to fall as Finland comes out to bury her dead. These are not soldiers who fell in battle on the field, but simple men and women who had to die to prove that might was right. But Finland's flag is still flying. Though she may pass through the valley of sorrow, though she may lose her liberty and her land, she fights on. And in the end, her spirit will triumph.